Hello everyone, this is Volt and welcome to a game called Outbreak and this is currently on the Xbox Series S, well basically it's an Xbox game and uh, I have had it for a long time and I haven't played it until now and the reason why I haven't played it yet is because there's been you know a lot of games in the backlog that just took my time and now that I've got kind of a bit of time I decided to use that time on this game for now and also there's another outbreak game called outbreak the new nightmare which i'm going to be checking out soon as well but i don't know how good or bad this game is as far as i know it's god awful but um i'm just going to give it a try anyway september 2016 a small weird midwestern town so basically this is taking huge inspiration from resident evil it was just another day, people going out about their lives wrapped up in their own work. The city was on the mend after a series of murders caused by an unknown killer. The police found him wandering in the woods, blood dripping from his mouth. A cannibal that was that massacred a family on a camping trip. Okay, those... wait. Oh, okay, so I can just do that. Those strange reports faded away. It was just a distant memory now. Everyone was safe and at ease, then one evening, seemingly out of nowhere, the attacks resumed. People were caught off guard and fell during the... People were caught off guard and fell during the onslaught. The infection spread from bites and scrapes. Before long, there was a monstrous horde. There was no escape as the streets were engulfed in panic and the city burned. Four individuals attempted to barricade themselves within the old hospital, hoping the walls would keep the horde at bay. Each there, each there by pure coincidence, but brought together and forced to survive. There's even more. They had many questions. Why this happened, how the infection spread, but in the end, none of that mattered. Their only priority was to find a way to escape and survive. This was their evening hell. Okay, I'm I'm glad that there's no more of that. From the developer, thank you for purchasing. Okay. So, yep, okay. Selection. Modern tank. Directly move tank style based on direction. Okay. Classic survival horror tank controls. Instantly move... Right, so that one's like a Resident Evil 1 remake, that one's probably going to be like Resident Evil original, and modern, so directly move tank style based on direction, I've no idea what that means, it just makes me feel like it's classic tank but modern, I have no idea, you know what, let's go for modern tank, sure, why the hell not, options, Supplier options, character Mason, move turn, oh, what does it mean move turn, okay, move turn, apply sure, uh, yep, back, okay, story, play, uh, why are they separated, shouldn't they just be in one, Let's just play, sure. Campaign and Onslaught. Nightmares. Experience the core outbreak campaign. Narratively. Why is this? So I'm guessing this is like classic Resident Evil and this one is more scarier or something. You know what? I'm going for Nightmares because... Uh, just your resident, just your general or generic resident evil is like meh to me now. So let's go for nightmares and see how that goes. So return to the world of survival horror as you experience short narrative vignettes with limited resources instead of the endless hordes. You'll be you'll face a more calculated apocalypse. So notes: game pauses when navigating menus. I mean. Uh, of course. Character selection is disabled. Okay. Character traits may be re remixed. Endless hordes are disabled. Okay. So, captive. You wake up in a blood-soaked prison. Terrified. 
you peer down the corridor with echoing moans. So, difficulty normal? I mean... It sounds like a good ad moment, so let's start the game. So here we go. Wait. So this is a 2D game. Not a 3D game. I'm... <laughs> I legit thought that this would be a 3D game and not a... This completely... Wiped my expectation. I mean, I'm not saying that this is already a bad game, because... Well, what? It's a dead end. No fit. So wait. Okay, so I can run. I can definitely run. Fine. Right, so inventory. Okie dokie, cool. Contagion. Torn piece of paper. Says 3585... 35845. So, that's definitely a code. 35845. I just wasn't expecting this to be a, two ga a 2D game, to be fair. And... Uh... Orders, uh, do not allow any prisoners past the checkpoint once they are admitted. Ensure all detainees are hooked up to the hallucinatory, okay? All written communications must be kept under lock and key. All arms must be safely locked up in one of the de designated armory lockers. That's a lot. Oh, okay, that, that was the last one, okay. So, what's this? Right, so three, five, eight, four, five. Find the armory. Oh wait, these herbs. Why even bother having plants if you aren't going to care for them properly? Okay, the restricted lab area. You know what? This reminds me of those sort of uh, RPG horror games. Um, just, you know, in Resident Evil format. Got a shining lock over here. Oh, got exclamation mark. Red salve, a chemical that enhances the healing properties of other salves. Cannot be used on its own. I've never even heard of a salve. But okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, we've got a lantern. But we can't even pick up the fucking lantern. It's all torn up and mostly illegible. Does it say Bew? Bew don't go. Labs in event of containment burr. Well, that's definitely containment breach. And it's definitely not SCP containment breach. Actually, is there another, like, a shining thing over here? No. I just thought I saw shiny stuff happen, but I guess not. Uh, anything over here? Oh, hi there. We're going to need to find some weapons. There's some horrifying noises, echoes out there. Okay, why did that come up even though I didn't actually talk to you? Oh, this is destroyed. But I can't do anything with it. Okay. Oh, is this locked? Oh, no. I was just garbage in the way, fuck. Okay, so modern tank controls is that, like, if you walk, let's say, over to here, and then you want to walk in the opposite direction, the character actually rotates toward that uh, direction. But when you have, like, uh, classic tank controls, you have to actually rotate your player in order to actually go forward in that direction. But because you're going in that direction, your player is rotation... Your player is rotating toward that direction already. So... Now I understand what it means by modern tank controls. Oh no, a lot of people have died here. What a tragedy. So I'm guessing this requires another code? Electronically locked. Oh, another one of those uh, vent thingies that we saw something inside of before. It's like a kitchen. Oh no, 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 this is a machine, isn't it? Or maybe not. Container is far larger than the others, it's coated in blood. Okay, reading out. Okay, so to be fair, nothing really has happened yet. To be, you know what? You know what? I'm gonna actually exit this game, and I want to check out Out Outbreak: The New Nightmare just to see what that one's like. Because I have a sneaky suspicion that it's gonna be pretty much 
similar or the same as the uh, Outbreak game. Okay, so here we are, new nightmare. Outbreak. Okay, so he says that, September 2016, viral epidemic. Okay, so we don't need to read all of that. Don't need to read all of that. So welcome to Outbreak Modern. Uh, you know what? Go for Modern again. Sure. Save and close. So, okay. Play. So it's going to be the, pretty much the same thing, isn't it? So start game. So load into... Okay, well, I guess we're loading onto tutorial then. Tutorial. Look. Oh, so this is 3D. <laughs> Why is this 3D but the other one is 2D? I mean, okay, that's, that's, that's cool, I guess. And not gonna lie, this kind of plays a little bit badly. I mean, the character... <laughs> you know what, let's just try and give this one a try, right? So, key, glorified key, we've got one. And we've got a piece of paper, which we can't even pick up. So wait, can I open up a door with this uh, key yet? Wait, how many? Where is a door around? Oh wait, this is a door, right? Door is locked. Need a gold key or a lock pick. I've got, got I've got a gold key, haven't I? Uh, no. Wait. No, I do have a gold key. I definitely. Wait. Oh wait. Use. Right. There we go. Nice. Well, hammer, I've also got a gun too. Uh. Oh no, wait. Yeah, definitely equip. And it's got a flashlight on. Okay, nice. And everything's burning, and I'm going toward the burning. <laughs> Search environment for useful supplies. Um. Oh, like this. Okay, nice. Got that. Um. Can I get anything else? Guess not. I'm guessing I can equip this. Yep. Okay, let's equip it. And of course it follows the same Resident Evil type thing. You can't move when you're actually aiming down your sights. Okay, cool. You can combine and use healing items from your inventory. Harry cannot combine items. Or c cannot combine healing items. Okay, so I currently have for handguns. So that means uh, if I get this, Combine with that. Or, yeah, combine with that. I guess the handgun has already been, um, reloaded, right? Yeah, I'm gonna guess so. Honestly, I feel like this plays really, really badly. Like, I, I genuinely do not like how this plays. I mean, I, I get what they were trying to do, but, oh, uh, I, oh, where's that coming from? That's coming from my left. Over here. But wait, we can't even move this shit. So, okay. Assault rifle. Nice. Can I, uh... Hang on a minute, can I... Can I reload this? I guess it's already been reloaded as well. Oh wait, that's the noise of this stuff, isn't it? Oh, oh wait, no it's not. Okay, so apparently, um, there's more than one button to uh, shoot your weapon. Real nice. Now, how the hell do you actually, uh, wait, combine? Right, so you do, you do it that way. So why does the assault rifle have little ammo? A bit stupid, but okay. Uh, where's the next zombie? There you are. Okay, nice. You are dead, mate. Okay, there's another zombie nearby. Ah, oh, there he is. Hello there, zombie. How are you doing today? I love how he just waited for me to like, get my ammo back.
All right. This game is fucking terrible. Okay, you know what? Let's just uh, use the assault rifle again, I guess. This game is actually fucking bad. Like, I'm actually laughing at how bad this game is, and I can understand why everyone's like, why everyone laughs at it now. It's actually pretty bad. I mean, I know that this is only the tutorial. Jesus Christ, I can't even believe what I'm playing now. In all honesty, I won't be continuing that. <laughs> I'm glad I tried it out though. I didn't want to like um just uh like uninstall it without at least trying it out. So I'm glad I tried it out and I hope that you enjoyed this video because oh my actual god, that was laughably bad. Like it wasn't even boring. It was just bad, but laughably bad. So anyway guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like and I'll see you guys in the next one. So yeah, um Goodbye, everybody.